Noob Noob, I heard you're going to go see an underage <clears throat> teen robot this weekend. What are you going to do with her? Uh, everything. Well, uh, technically it's legal because she's not a person. So I can do whatever I want. <laughs> oh, so because she's not a human, you can do whatever you Absolutely. want. Absolutely. That's how it works. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, that's right, friends. It's Our Reviews Will Kill You, and we're going to talk a little bit about some of the freaky deaky marketing that we've gotten from Z Megan. What are you stopping, you freak? <laughs> it's Megan. Me Threegan? Me Threegan. Me Threegan. Yes. Let's get Threegan. They've passed Me Tooed. She's, me, she's gone beyond they've me too. They've me threegand. They've me threegand. Uh, we're excited to see it. Are you? I'm super excited. Let us know down in the comments below. I want Megan to dance on my balls. I mean, that's a thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And well, like, she, doggy run at me or whatever she does. In whatever the nonsensical dancing yeah. that she does and do some magical dancing. I want a small pocket lesbian to just get on all fours and run towards my penis. <laughs> run through you? Yeah. Uh-huh. Fucking run at me like a fucking savage German Wait shepherd. the cursing. Looking for a pepperoni. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, apparently, me three and take, took over a NFL game and leaves football fans stunned. Oh, my God. Oh. I mean, we'll check it out. It looks a little creepy. What is this? Is this on the field? Oh, yeah, this is, this is the... What? This is on the field. Was this um, like a halftime thing? Yes. Was it really? Mm-hmm. They must have paid a good amount for this. Ah, I think it's like the Chargers. So like, eh. No, the LA Chargers, Chargers are in the playoffs. They struggle to fill their stadiums. That's because LA doesn't care. That's exactly right. LA doesn't care about football at all. Yeah. Let's take a closer look. I legit thought they were about to do a dance. They do a dance, just not the dance. That's dumb. Why would you not do the dance? I don't know. Are you going to do the dance? I don't know if I can in this state. Not, not right. Oh, look, but it's the real Slim Shady. The real Slim Megan? The real Slim Megan. So this is a, uh, they're saying, this is a Blumhouse production. I think we looked it up. It has a $12 million budget. It does. A Smile, which we enjoyed, had a $17 million budget. 216 million in the box office. I think this could do something similar. Uh, it's wait, Smile gonna... did 216 million? Yeah, it did really well. It had really good, uh, real good legs and <laughs> real good word, word of mouth. Yeah. Yeah. I, I would recommend Smile. I, it's, it's all right. For a, a modern horror movie, I thought it was pretty good. Yeah. Megan's going to be better. Yeah, but it's only PG 13, so it might get more butts in the seats. I did hear a review. And I'm, I don't remember who it was. I do, but I can't. John Johns or something like that. He said that uh, you can clearly tell that the movie was edited to be a PG-13 because there are lines that seem ADR'd, like recorded after the fact, that are not matching the movie. Like, you MF in little robot, biatch. And then it's like, you robot, be oh, it. really? Yeah, like oh. he said, just so keep an eye out for some lines that look a little funky. Let's see. Oh, my gosh. What else these Megans were doing? That's look, how kinda, sad, that's, that's, look how sad they look. That's kind of disturbing. I Yeah. But I'm a little aroused. I know. <laughs> Turned on or, and... Uh, like, yeah. they're clearly attractive. And you did say, you said it was Smile-esque marketing stunt. And we didn't catch the Smile marketing stunt. Yeah. We missed it. I think it was a lot of people smiling in a stadium. Yeah, it was just like doing weird smiles in stadiums. Yeah, I heard yeah. about that. It was kind of weird. We didn't actually watch it. But here are me and my besties. Oh, my God. Wanted to watch sports today. Go Chargers. Oh, my God. And wouldn't you be creeped out if you saw this? I just would be like, you want to come home with me, girls? Like, what do you know? Hey, ladies. You ready to party? <laughs> There's okay. a lot of them though, too. Like you gotta like just. You I know, think they're like cheerleaders or something. Wall averages, you get. One we wanted more. to host the Chargers game, so we found Donnie Hoyt, and now we are kissing. <laughs> Turn off that. Oh my god. What oh, okay. Oh fuck. <laughs> yep. Spider walking. What? Who? <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. Oh, what's going on here? 
Uh, if I was, I would give up. If I, I feel were like this is fan. more elaborate than the smile propaganda they were doing, because like smile was just having people weirdly smile. On oh, finally, thing. here's the uh, halftime show energy with my besties. Okay, is there dancing? Yes, the whole guerrilla marketing thing worked. For me. Oh, what the? Oh my god, they are flexible. Oh my god, <laughs> that's creepy, man. What? <laughs> that's pretty cool, right? Why? Oh. Why would they not just do a group dance of the Megan dance? Like, I don't understand. Because they're trying to be uber creepy. I don't know. I don't know, man. I didn't oh, choreograph uh, this. No, no, that's kind of like, that's kind of the dance. It's kind of the dance. It's a oh, here bit. we oh, go. There, yeah, we go. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, that, that's yeah. kind of the dance. It's kind of. It's more cheerleader-y than it is. Yeah. What are they doing? Thumb wars now? Uh, I don't know. That's kind of the dance. That's okay. That's fine. You're still in though. Oh my god, yes. You're in it to win it. I'm in it even I'm seeing it literally tomorrow. I mean, I've heard good things. I will definitely watch this. I may not go out to the theaters to watch it, but I'll watch it. Oh no, it's so scary. I don't know how it's gonna end. I like I I yeah, I don't know how the ending I think is going to be important for me to whether it's like just okay or great. It is weird. James Wan did write part of this and he clearly doesn't like dolls. Or does like dolls. Yeah, I was gonna say he did Annabelle. Conf well, does he like dolls a lot or does he just like dolls? I heard a review that the the AI Chucky remake walked so this movie could run. <laughs> okay, that's fair enough. Yeah. Cause I yeah, the AI Chucky remake was like, eh, this seems more it's it's just different. And I heard there's some good concepts in here. So I'm excited. You'll have to give us a great review of it. Or a bad review. I will give the Megan review. I'll just dance the entire time. The Megan I'll just dance in a speedo. Megan dance. Well, I, you, why don't you just buy her I will like, little run, dress? There's gonna be. A, we're gonna release a short where it's just me naked running on all fours towards you. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Galloping. You're just gonna be screaming. I mean, I may be doing those things. No, Daddy Yami Tay. No, Daddy Yami Tay. Oh, well, anyway, uh, yeah, we're in it. Are you interested in Megan in a platonic way? Or do you just want to see her in her movie? You tell us. Because she could be ambiguous. She could be anything you want her to be. You just got to reskin her. Anyway, be sure to catch our full-length audio podcast. That is on Friday nights, 7.30 Eastern Standard Time, live on YouTube. We're also on Rumble. We're also uh, that same podcast is on iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, all those great places and more. Be sure to check them out. They are free to you as we grow. Share this video, like it, subscribe, do all those great things. Because if you do not subscribe, there is a distinct possibility that Noob Noob does this. I will hold you down and Megan dance on your balls while your parents watch. And they will not be happy about it. Or maybe they will be. And then we're, we'll do some weird sex things with your parents. And then you'll watch. So either way, you're going to be mentally scarred for life. So it's a win-win for me. <laughs> as long as Noob Noob wins, it's yes. a win for everyone. So anyway, uh, that wraps it up for us here at Our Reviews Will Kill You. We love y'all. Thanks for listening. And we'll catch you on the next one.